300,000. Thank you so much, everybody. I cannot say enough. I am so thankful. You guys rock. Thank you for hitting that subscribe button. And if you're not subscribed, hit that subscribe button. It's completely free. It helps the channel grow the way I keep bringing you the best content possible. So what are we doing for 300,000? Well, a very, very, very popular request all the time is fish and chips. And today we are back in an all you can eat fish and chips. So I have always been kicked out of all you can eat fish and chips. Yes, every single fish and chip restaurant that offered an all you can eat that I've ever been to, I've gotten kicked out of. So hopefully today will be different. So today we are at Joey's Seafood in Brantford, Ontario. I have never been here before. All I know is they offer an all you can eat fish and chips on Tuesdays. I don't know if there's any rules, restrictions. The price if you want Pollock is $17. If you want Cod, I don't know if it's real Cod, is $22. They say it's all you can eat, it's offered all day. Let's go find out, really put this to the test. Let's see if we can eat 30 pieces of fish. Let's see if they even give us 30 pieces of fish and we don't get kicked out. Oh, hey, by the way, we're in 4K today. Comment down below if you like that and hopefully we'll have some more 4K coming your way. So definitely hit that subscribe button. And uh, at that, let's head on in, let's eat some food. All you can eat fish and chips. Let's hopefully not get kicked out. Let's have some fun. All right, everyone, so we got our first order. Uh, very simple rules. They said just tell them when you want more pieces. Uh, they start you off with three pieces, coleslaw, some fries as well. I already asked them to put in uh, a few more pieces for me. I explained that I'm gonna try to eat as many as I can. And of course, if I don't eat any, they can charge me full price. I'll pay them, no problem with that. So uh, ultimately, let's get started here. Should be good. I got some ketchup and tartar sauce, my absolute favorites. and. Uh, Pollock. Oh yeah, I went with the Pollock version. At least starting with the Pollock. Maybe we'll switch over, but for now, let's try this. <laughs> let's try it by itself first. Hot. Good though. Hey everyone, welcome to this video where today we are here taking on the arch nemesis of restaurants. An all-you-can-eat fish and chip restaurant. 100% of the time that I have ever been to an all-you-can-eat fish and chips, I have been kicked out. And today, we're going to try not to get kicked out. Oh, cool. Amazing. Thank you so much. And there you go. That's a good way to start. Got another uh, four pieces here, actually. Thumbnail. I appreciate that. That's a good start. Very hot though, need to let it cool down. Tartar sauce is a bad. So we were at Joey's Seafood in Brantford, Ontario, and let's start by saying, guys, thank you so much, everybody, for 300,000 subscribers. It is because of you, because of that 300,000, that I risked getting kicked out of another all-you-can-eat, risked getting cut off at this fish and chip restaurant. Because why? Because you all hit that subscribe button. And if you haven't before, hit it now. And who knows what we'll do next. We will definitely do more crazy eating endeavors. But here, let's get to the fish and chips. Definitely made fresh, definitely hot. Come here, this will be number three. So as I mentioned, you could go with like the Pollock, which was actually about fifteen fifty before tax, or you could go with the Haddock slash Cod, which was $22. I asked the lady what she preferred. She said the, the Pollock was good, so I said, let's do it. Solid taste though. I'll see these fried. Then our next pieces. So when I went into the restaurant, I very much told them, I said, hey, I'm doing a YouTube video and I'm gonna to try to eat as many pieces of fish as I could, can. And they said, okay, sure, whatever. Which was, I think, a good start, off to a good start. So the way this works is the first order is generally uh, two pieces of fish and then the fries. So what the lady was able to do is give me, uh, you know, again, the beginning order and also put in the next order right away, to which generally they would only do like an extra one or two pieces at a time, but she was willing to give me three or four at a time, which was really great to start off with. I was very, very happy um, and was hoping again that I would not get kicked out because I knew we were going to eat a lot of fish. Number four. 
Tempter hot. I should have brought a bottle of ketchup. Should have brought my own. They have packets right now, and I think we're going to be using a lot of those. Did I have a number goal in mind? Well, I don't know. I thought maybe 30 would be interesting, if we could make it to 30. The first time I went to an all-you-can-eat fish and chips, I had a goal of 30, and I got cut off at 8 pieces. The second time I went to an all-you-can-eat fish and chips, we were trying to at least hit like 25, maybe 30 pieces, and we basically got cut off around like 12-ish. So, like I said, the fact that they were here at least willing to give us a couple pieces at a time was really a good sign. Um, so it's when it came to like the fries, the fries were fine. The fish itself was pretty good. Um, it was definitely a mild batter, uh, so you definitely got the flavor of whether it be like a condiment, like a ketchup or a tartar sauce or lemon or kind of really whatever you're using. It definitely, that would be the strongest flavor of it. The Pollock itself was a very light white fish. Um, in fact, I would almost go as far to say it was not, like it definitely wasn't fishy at all. Um, very, very light. In regards to the, like it being cooked, it was cooked very proper. I mean, it was again, quite obviously like coming out very fresh. It was being made to order very hot. Um, some pieces, you know, kind of had a little bit extra moisture in them, um, but hey, it was all good. Like there, you can see it's a little, little drippy. Um, in regards of the ketchup and tartar sauce combination, if you're wondering what I'm doing, okay, I know some parts of the world, some people think it's tomato sauce. It's not tomato sauce. It's ketchup. It is different. And tartar sauce, well, I mean, that's that's pretty standard. I found the tartar sauce here at Joey's Seafood. Um, as Joey's is a chain restaurant, this was a standardized tartar sauce. It was fair um, in the capacity of like the tartar sauces I've had. Um, it definitely, again, I would, I would kind of say like didn't have overly strong flavors. Again, kind of a very, mm, I don't know if I want to say generic, but a very kind of generic-ish tartar sauces. I, I guess how I could describe it. So two more, so that would be, this would be nine. So we did seven and nine. So at this point, we're already approaching the number of fish to which I got cut off at the first fish and chip restaurant, all you can eat fish and chip restaurant I ever went to. By the way, I'm gonna link the videos down below of the times I got kicked out of all you can eat fish and chips in case you haven't seen them. Definitely hot, that's definitely the thing. Like every time they come out, definitely a bit of a cool down period, otherwise you're burning the roof of your mouth. Make sure that's steaming. Because it's steaming. I know some people like lemon on their fish. I don't. Well, some fish, maybe it's like not breaded, but deep fried, nah. But again, our server, at least at this point, at least at this point, was still being very warming um, and offering, you know, the pieces. I will say though, I think it was like a manager or somebody else they started to kind of walk around the restaurant a little bit and i know they were like a manager or an owner or somebody because on my way to the restroom you kind of went past an office and the individual was sitting in there and i saw her starting to kind of walk around and kind of scope around and at this point i started to hear a little bit of conversation about like you know how many pieces that that guy over there with the camera was eating and i think we've only been here like maybe 20 minutes like since i entered so we're doing really well actually i'm, I'm very impressed Maybe 25. Yeah, close enough. And here, here's that, here's that fish imagery. In case you need some fish imagery, focus on the fish. It's good. It's solid. Definitely light, flaky. Not a super strong, like, mm, not a super strong flavor on the batter, so it really absorbs, like, the ketchup or the tartar sauce or the lemon, like, whatever you put on it. So based on some of those conversations, I was kind of getting a little weary, or at least was a, I don't know if I want to say I was quite worried, but a little weary, that's for sure. As again, you have to understand, the only thing I've ever known is 
going to an all-you-can-eat fish and chips, and getting kicked out very early on. So I was appreciating each piece by piece, knowing that that could happen at any point in time. Hot. All right, there you go. So we are nine in, waiting for some more, and uh, we'll see how this goes. All right, we got a few more pieces. So now this is, we have four more here. So this will bring us to 13, 13 pieces of fish. Pobis, a little pobis. There you go. There's our Pollock. And we already got the, I've never seen somebody eat this much, but you know, so we're, and we're only at 13, well, nine. We're at nine, so, but luckily we got some more in. I uh, really appreciate the staff so far. It's been fantastic. The service has been amazing. Um, she bring me waters without me asking. Same as like, I uh, got some more ketchup and tartar sauce. I officially got the sauce plate. Awesome. Although, these are very hot. Like I said, you definitely gotta let them cool off when they come on out. As they are just absolutely rolling steam. Very good. That ketchup tartar sauce combination is fantastic. The fish is really nice. I am enjoying it. Definitely. Nothing wrong with that. And you gotta try this combo. It's not tomato sauce, some people call it tomato sauce, it's ketchup. It's very different. And the combination on fried fish, only on fried fish, is fantastic. What was amazing is again like the speed they were giving the pieces which was awesome. Pretty much every time they dropped some off they were putting more in which was amazing. Again, so I really wasn't even here that long and I was already, you know, so many pieces into it. Um, it, like it was really starting to boggle my mind and I was so excited I couldn't believe I even made it this far without getting cut off as again this would be as like the furthest the most pieces I've ever been able to eat at any all-you-can-eat fish and chip restaurant so that puts out 13 I think I'm gonna start writing this down so I keep track of this um, but yeah really enjoyed it really good so far I think my camera's a little crooked I'm gonna try to fix it here but what else is really cool that I noticed on the wall there is apparently they offer an all-you-can-eat fish tacos on Thursday, which I maybe will have to come try out. All right, and we got five more, putting, if we finish these, to a total of 18. Again, currently, we have 13 consumed. This will be 18. So, here we go. Hopefully we hit that 30 number. You know, like I said, we got 300,000. Thank you again, really appreciate that. Um, let me know what you think of the video so far. Let me know if you like the uh, all you can eat fish and chip concept. And let me know. Let me know if you think they're gonna allow us to keep going. The fact that I was still able to get like four or five pieces at a time was just like, again, mind blowing. I really could not believe it. Definitely excited about it. And I was starting to think like, is it possible somehow maybe I wouldn't get kicked out? And I, I knew it was going to happen at some point, but when were they going to cut me off? When were they going to actually kick me out? I might actually resort to some lemon. Let's, let's try it. I'll try it for all y'all out there. I'm willing to try it. I'll try it again. Alright, alright. 
it's not bad. Refill the sauce plate, definitely get some more ketchup. And we have three left. So 15 right now. Halfway. Amazing. Can I buy you for some more ketchup, please? Sure. Yeah. Thanks so much. We got four more there. This is good because it'll give these some time to cool off. And then, hopefully, by the time we're done, these will be all cooled out. Amazing, thank you. You're welcome. Do you want me to put more in? Um, yeah, sure, put another four more. Why not? We're in it now. Okay. We're in it now. This is a really good sign. I'm really impressed. Really happy. I'm ecstatic. Can we take the time to appreciate the 4K quality? If you like it and you want to see more 4K videos, please comment down below and let me know. Even these ones that have been here for a while, I don't know if you can see it, but they are just piping. Piping on. Focus. Comment down below how many ketchup packets you think I'm going to use by the time I leave. And whoever is the closest, I'll pin your comment. 300,000, this is for you. So as I said, I could not believe how many pieces I was getting. And the server was very, very supportive. She was being absolutely awesome. Um, you know, whether I needed the water, ketchup, tartar sauce, she was definitely on top of it. And again, just the fact that she was willing to just keep putting pieces in and pieces in was like, it was, again, I was just mind blown. I couldn't believe that I made it this far. And I thought maybe, maybe, just maybe I'd actually hit our goal. Maybe we could get, you know, kind of, well, at least, you know, 30 in, or who really knows how many. The fact that we weren't cut, we, you know, we didn't get cut off or we didn't get any slack yet was just amazing. Um, it was all positivity. And, but this is where, again, I was really, I started to get a little more worried. I'm not gonna lie, I'm super impressed. Before, the closest we ever got it somewhere was about 12 pieces. Right now, we're sitting at 22 plus. So, well, 22 on, on the table, and then plus the order, so. Maybe we will not get kicked out. Not jinxing it, this is awesome. So these four have been cooling off. We also just got a fresh five. So this brings us to 31 if we can do that. So another thumbnail. So with that, this actually bring us over the 300,000 goal. So I, know, I guess we'd have to keep rocking and rolling. This is insane. One thing's for sure though, my mouth is so burnt. The up, like the top of my mouth, my, my tongue, it's probably just gonna peel later. But I'm still enjoying it, it's still very, very good. So the fact that we had our goal in eyesight, literally within my grasp, was just, I was just so shocked. I was so excited, I couldn't believe it. Somehow we actually found a fish and chip restaurant that really seemed to be all you can eat. That's what it seemed like. So here I was, you know, trying not to get kicked out. And the fact that we are hitting 30 and it didn't happen yet, I can't believe it. And we've been here for about just under an hour. And that's like walking the door. So we've been eating probably for about 45, 50 minutes at this point. Let's see if, about 40, about 40. 26.
I'm gonna let those cool off. All right, so I took the uh, like the last five, so bring us to 31, I broke one in half, just to try to let them like, cool off a little bit on the inside. The batter does kind of hold the heat in a bit. Um, so let's get these done. I did order a couple more as well. So uh, we are over the three zero mark. So 300,000, thank you again, everybody. This is for you, I appreciate you. And uh, I guess we'll just see where the ceiling is a little bit. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what happens. I'll, I'll stop eventually, so we'll, but we'll have some fun in the meantime. We got another five, five pieces. I gotta make the faces, okay? I just gotta. The server we had was also super awesome. Um, in fact, at one point she even looked at me and said something along the lines of like, you can do it, Brucey, which is a reference to the Matilda movie where they are cheering on a gentleman to eat basically a big, big chocolate cake. So she was actually like cheering me on, like, you know, and by all means all the staff and her and everybody was saying like they've never seen anybody eat this many at all i think they said previously the most they've ever seen or heard somebody eat was eight and of course we were still going we hadn't even stopped yet and like i said with the time updates we were doing really really good for time we came at the right time and everything was going quick So that's 31. Here we have a few more. They'll let them cool off a little bit, that's for sure. But here we go. All right, so I was actually misspoke. We actually have six on this plate that was cooling off. So this would be 37. And then we got three more bringing us to 40. So this is now the 4 0 run right here. But to do so, we have nine pieces. It's a lot of food. Let's put it that way. I think our server's leaving, I think we changed shifts. Are you, are you heading out then? Huh? Are you heading out? You common question is do I tip at restaurants when I eat and the answer is absolutely. In fact, I tipped two servers here at the restaurant, our first amazing one and the second one, you know, and I actually paid way more in tips than I did for the actual cost of food. So yes, I definitely tip and I tell you good service, an excellent experience, it, get, it gets rewarded. That's just of course, that's what I do. And I have to say our server was absolutely amazing, shout out to her. We've now been eating for about an hour and like five-ish, maybe Here. 10 minutes. Mm -hmm. Throwing Ooh. again? Oh. Lots of ketchup, lots of tartar sauce, lots of fish. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's hit the 40. I think we'll, I think we'll call it quits then. We've, we definitely had our fill. Thirty-seven down, three to go. Woo. Hot. I'm heating up. Probably all the sugar, not to mention all the hot food. Whew. But uh, I'm finished the season. I think we'll probably call it there. We were three hundred thousand after all. But now this could be good for four hundred thousand too. Forty. But we'll uh, we'll stick for now. We'll have to beat it next time. All right, so let's get these done. Mm. Finally cooled off. It's, like I said, it's hard to eat them real hot. They come out fresh, and the roof of my mouth doesn't really uh, always appreciate that as much as, as that all my everything else does. But that, everybody, that's pretty much the uh, fish and chip experience. You know, I'll leave us to enjoy the rest of it, to hit that final number, 
And uh, at that, I just want to thank you so much for 300,000. Thank you for your support. Thank you for hitting that like button. Thank you for commenting down below. And uh, let me know, actually, speaking of which, what should I eat next? Comment down below. Let me know. And by the way, hit that subscribe button. You all rock. Could I get another water? Then I'll just take my bill. Another water? Yeah, no problem. All right, well, there you go. We definitely tested it out and it stood, it stood. I have no complaints. It was like a really great experience. Um, you know, so huge thanks to everybody here. This was really cool. This is the first time I've ever been in All You Can Eat Fish where I can actually, you know, release the name. So it's been positive though. I really liked it. We're looking back, maybe, maybe on the Thursday. All You Can Eat Fish Tacos. But yeah, everybody, hope you enjoyed it. Again, I really appreciate you. This is for 300,000. Let's hit the next landmark. I'll do something even crazier, but I tell you, I'm very full. I've had a lot of fish and chips and uh, a lot of fish to be specific. Anyway, that was it, it was crazy. I can't believe we actually are still here. We're still, like, we didn't get kicked off, didn't get cut out. So that was pretty cool. So everybody, till next time, of course, stay happy, all the hungry, happy eating. Like I said, I appreciate you. If you liked the video, hit that like button, I'll comment down below, and uh, hit the subscribe button if you're new around here. Really appreciate that as well. So, that's it, 300,000, you rock. Have a lovely day. everyone thank you so much for watching today's video i really appreciate it if you click my face right here you can subscribe yes that's right click my face subscribe guys it helps me out it helps you out then you don't miss an upload and hopefully i can meet you when i come to your city also click a video right here i specifically pick two videos yes that's right two videos specifically for you right here so click a video right now get that going and it's going to end so click one quick let's go let's go and have a great day